I know one thing, that can stay. So as you can see, the sun is out. It is Monday the 12th. Still no grafter, but apparently today or tomorrow, who knows? I'm slightly over it now. Uh, when it comes, it comes. <laughs> At least they're doing a good job. They're doing it properly. And there is quite a few bits they've added, which uh, I'll show you guys when it does eventually turn up. Just had lunch. I've been on deliveries this morning. I am just going to nip to the petrol station. Didn't realise we were low on uh, petrol for the chainsaw. When we get back, we're going to have a big sort out of timber. So we've got quite a bit of decent sized timber in at the moment, but a lot of it needs cleaning up. So I'm going to get Andy in the digger and we're going to try and clean up the wood as much as possible up the track at the timber stack so we can keep the mess up there in the field. Um, I'm going to get my chainsaw trousers on and stuff like that and, and as I say we're going to just try and clean up as much timber as possible with it being such a nice day today. So as you can see, we've got some cleaning up to do on these logs. And then we're going to go up there and do some cleaning up, up the stack. So, uh, and he's just lined them up off the floor on top of the log, so it keeps us out of the concrete. And uh, clean them up nice and easily there. Let's get this 500 eye going and warmed up. Oh, 
just go through. I don't know. Oh, 
Oh, I don't know actually, might be oversized. It's a bit punky as well. Oversized. stuff in the gap it's like borderline perfect and then it just needs a couple of little bits to clean off Oh, 
So that log was 430 mil. I didn't think it was going to fit through, but it does. It's about 17 inches. There's some lovely bits of timber. Run that in through today. I'd like to try and get this side cleared up if I can. There's a lot of cleaning up to do here. That's all chip. That's all oak. That's all oversized. A lot of that's oak. So the plan for next week, when we're driving on the concrete, 
we're gonna do a full couple of days or however long it takes to uh, process all this oak. And we're gonna make it slightly, we're gonna keep the same length, but we're gonna make them slightly smaller in diameter uh, and, and then market them as pizza logs in the summer, pure oak pizza logs. So yes, they're smaller and they'll create more flame, but because they're oak, they'll give you that smoky flavor as well as uh, giving you a good coal bed. So that's my plan, I'm probably shouting. Um, that's my plan for the oak. I feel like I can get a little bit better premium at it. And what we'll do is we can load it up into barrow bags for the summer. Try and keep some income coming in over the summer. So we've got quite a lot of oak here. All that down, down there is oak. And then we've just pulled out some more oak up here. We're just trying to keep it separate. And then what we'll do is we'll clean it all up next week, as I say. Um, pure oak baskets be lovely and then we can just season it on the concrete until we need it in the spring and it will take less time in the kiln I would like to have just a big sort out here really so clean up all the timber move the bearers the bits of wood that the timber is sat on because that keeps it off out the mud uh, move them out of the way and I would like to um, get in here with the bucket and feather all this bark and stuff out and then the grass can grow through it um, it's all built up at the moment just where it falls off the logs from here onwards is absolutely fine but this is the main area that we 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 stack logs and use it straight away and obviously here as well so i'd like to try and organize a lorry for chip this is all the tiny stuff literally tiny it just takes a bit too long to process and then we also have some chestnut in here and I don't want to sell that to my customers in case it spits in their fire. So that's gonna go for chip as well as some stuff up there. The oversize is being sold. Temptation to just drive on there and put some nice stacks of timber in. <laughs> we are running out of bit of room here though. I'll be honest. Whoa.
sweet puppet here because I'm tired of bumping, bumping over bits and bobs. I'm gonna clean up. Well, that's gonna be it for this video, guys. The yard's definitely a lot tidier, and we've got plenty of processable timber. I'm just gonna keep eating away through it. We do potentially have some more timber coming in the yard tomorrow. I know I said I want to get it cleaned up, but when the timber's available, uh, you can't say no. So, uh, yeah, potentially a load or two coming in tomorrow, which is nice. That is going to be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you hit the thumbs up, subscribe. It really does help. I'll see you guys in the comments, and I'll see you on the next one. Cheers.